if we can assign the curve's shape data to individual vertices. Modeling will be much more convenient. In this video, we will look at how to transform the shape of a mesh through Bezier curves. Apply a geometry node to the default cube. Since we are going to transform the shape, subdivide it sufficiently. Now create a curve to deform the shape. Add one Bezier curve object and make a shape in edit mode. Since we are going to transform the shape of this cube by using a curve object, add a set position node to the cube. Drag and drop the curve into the geometry node editor. To get the curve's position data, add a sample curve node. Add a vector math node to transform the position using sample curve data. Connect the position node. If you connect the position node to the factor socket, you can see that the shape of the curve affects the cube's deformation. Add a separate XYZ node, so it only affects the X-axis. Add a map range node to give predictable control. You can now design mesh shapes by transforming the shape of the curves.